All right, in the last demo, really quickly, I showed you how I centered a photo <clears throat> on the page by uh, using Smart Guides. So this demo is gonna focus more on just centering content again. So I'm gonna go to File and Open. In Chapter 3, folder number 5, Centering Content. I'm gonna open this InDesign file. And we've got a photo. This is Jonah and Dad center this text on the screen. See, it's way over to the left. Without even having to use measurements, I wanna make sure view and grids and guides and smart guides are turned on. So now when I click on this box and I just drag it over right there, I can see that it has been centered. You can see the center, <coughs> excuse me, the center of this box has an X on it, and that center X is now right on that guide. So I have centered it from left to right. Okay, I can take this photo, not clicking on the center, but near a corner, click and drag, and I will get the same center X. And now that's lined up, centering my content. Okay, if I clicked on a center of a photo and I accidentally tried to move it like that and I drag it out, don't try to move it back in because then you might be off a little bit like this. Okay, and you're not really filling the box. So if you accidentally do that and you forgot, if you do that and you immediately realize it, you can just hit Command Z. But if you don't and you kind of, wait, oh shoot, what did I do? What you can do is just go to Object, Fitting, and Center the Content again. Okay? That is the easiest way to do it. Just be aware that it, when you have Smart Guides, you can drag these things around, and now your center points will line up with those Smart Guides. Great way to center objects on a page. That's it.